video. Today we're going to be discussing Monero mining profitability. Um, I get asked this question a lot and I think it um, I think I address it formally in this video. So um, is Monero mining profitable? Uh, the short answer is depends. Um, uh, what I mean by this is it really just depends on your CPU. Um, for example, like if you have um, a really old laptop, like it's 10 years or old, um, you're not going to be looking to make um, really big profits. That's like really good passive income. You're just looking to make a little bit of spare change, but it's not really going to be anything serious. But on the other hand, if you have a um, gaming CPU or maybe just a high-end CPU, like a maybe AMD Ryzen 9 or a Threadripper, um, then yes, I think it is very profitable to mine Monero. Um, because Monero, once again, is the most efficient coin that you can mine on your CPU. And if you have a high-end CPU, yeah, I think it's a great way to make some good income um, on the side of what else, you, whatever else you may be doing. The profitability of um, Monero mining really just depends on your CPU. So if we head it over and just search on Google, most profitable CPUs to mine Monero. Um, number one, AMD uh, Ryzen Threadripper. It says um, it can get about 19.9 kilohashes per second. And um, this hash rate, kilohashes per second, is um, basically how many calcul guesses at the mathematical... Um, so each block is a mathematical problem that is presented to the computer. Um, the computer that solves this block the fastest gets the reward of the coins. So you want to have a higher hash rate. So 19.9 um, <clears throat> kilohashes is the hash rate for this AMD Ryzen 30 operator 3970X. Um, and if you plug it into a any um, mining Monero mining calculator, um, you can see the exact profitability. So the hash rate of, was 19.9. Power consumption, um, <clears throat> it doesn't say. Uh, I don't think it says. So I believe 1200 is a little high for um, any computer. But you get the point. You can just fill all your details out for your CPU, um, including hash rate, power consumption in watts, and then your electricity bill, so your cost per kilowatt hour. So how much money you have to pay in electricity for each kilowatt hour, and of course the pool fee, um, which is how much money, um, the what percentage of the reward the pool is going to deduct from your earnings. So... Um, uh, for example, my computer has a 2.3 gigahertz quad core Intel Core i7, which, um, through my testing, gets around 1 to 1.5 kilohashes per second. It's not the most efficient machine, but I I just like to put it to work anyways, make some passive income. Um, I this might be borderline profitable because it's on a laptop and typically laptops take up you and use less electricity than your powerful desktops um, so this I'd say from my own testing I'd say uh, it makes about 12 cents per day but because it's so power efficient um, I get about eight sense and profit I'm not sure on the exact numbers I haven't checked in a long time I just I just like to let this thing run and do its thing I, like I said before and I'm gonna keep saying it uh, the proper profitability for any type of mining is gonna be based on your hardware and because um, especially with old computers like um, like this one that I'm filming on right now 2012 they're going to be best mine, mining Monero unless you have some sort of graphics card. Um, 
I know the most more efficient algorithms, ET hash requires six gigabytes of VRAM. Um, ET cache also um, requires six gigabytes of VRAM. And then CowPow, which requires three gigabytes. So um, if you do have those, great. They're, pro they're probably more efficient than um, CPU mining. But because Monero was built to be um, CPU mineable and mainly mine my CPUs, um, it's ASIC resistant, um, so um, it's the most, most efficient um, crypto to mine with your CPU, and the profitability, how much you're going to make, just depends on your hash rate and your hardware. So that'll do it for this video, um, hope you guys enjoyed, and make sure to subscribe and like.